With Seaborn Quest, like her two sisters uh, before her, the Seaborn Odyssey and Sojourn, are absolutely game changers in the ultra luxury cruise marketplace. Everything about them is quality and luxury in every way possible. It's amazing to see that a piece of steel can actually transform into something so beautiful as a luxury cruise line. If you look around and you tour this vessel, you know, you'll be amazed at just the absolute stunning uh, quality of it. We've been able to take some of the things that folks love the most about our original fleet of three ships and really build upon it, taking the best of what our guests love about the smaller ships and just expanding on that a little bit. Well, our suites are really designed to be a home away from home, a walk-in closet, a personalized bar, space to really live, uh, space to be comfortable. You can entertain, you can have a cocktail party in your suite. Uh, they are absolutely terrific. One of my favorite um, areas of the ship is Seaborn Square. It's a wonderful meeting place. It's an area where guests can enjoy a coffee, library, internet access. If they have anything that they need in terms of shore excursions or guest services, it's all there located in one warm, inviting venue. The variety is what the guests enjoy. So if they feel like just being a private moment and they go observation lounge and they have a great drink there and listen to the pianist who plays their favorite songs, or as some guests like to have an elaborate show and then they go on the show lounge, we also have often guest entertainers and local entertainment on board, which is enhancing the cruise experience as well. We have a number of beautiful venues in which uh, our guests can dine. Uh, starting from the restaurant, which is a beautiful room that's elegantly appointed. We also have uh, an alternative venue called the Colonnade. A little bit more casual, uh, very comfortable, and a terrific place for a meal. Restaurant 2 is, is very dramatic. The, uh, the seating itself, there's a, uh, quite a few tables for two, so it's a very intimate space. Guests will find a lot more in the way of uh, shady areas, for one thing, but also uh, larger pools, uh, a much larger sky bar area surrounding the pool, a patio grill, just a place where people can really meet and interact during the daytime. The larger ships have given us the ability to create some really wonderful smaller deck areas as well with hidden pools, fountains, uh, more jacuzzis. We've maintained the, the Seaborn signature of that wonderful spa on the very front of the ship in the bow, which guests really love and enjoy. This is a huge spa. and We have treatment rooms. We have uh, a beautiful spa villa where you can have a whole meal. We're gonna, you can book that for a whole day. You can have your treatments there. Invite your family, invite your friends, like it's your own private yacht and nobody's around because that is privately for you. One of my favorite places uh, is the marina. The marina is something that's unique to Seaborn. Uh, it's a great place to be able to enjoy uh, the sunshine, water sports, and really get uh, more up close and personal with the, with the destination that, that you're in. Our service approach is intuitive, it's personal, it's sincere, it's friendly, and uh, we understand at the core that everyone is an individual, everyone has different needs and different wishes, and it is simply our pleasure to be in service. So it's just beyond any ordinary service. It's, I would say, an unparalleled level of attentiveness and attention to details. It's just different than anything out there, and that's what our guests like and really enjoy. It's not just a cruise, it's, it's, it's a second home for them, and, and they just love it. I'm a very proud captain, especially when I see all these hard-working men and women that is taking that hard work with a great smile in a truly seaborne way.